taming oneself means uh, uh, there's always ideal side of yourself that how you want it to be. I want it to be nice, effortlessly nice. I want it to be kind, effortlessly kind. I want it to be, I want it to just relax, effortlessly relax. So you have ideal side of you and then, but you have the other side which follows, does not follow at all that rule, right? And if it, even it's trying to do that, it's so much effort to do that. So there's whole another side of you. And so sometimes in, in, in extreme cases, we can think about like addictions. Basically, all the addictions are uh, from extreme cases like drug abusive and substance abusive and, and, and then just um, habit of getting angry, habit of getting agitated, habit of worrying for no reasons, uh, habit of getting restless, uh, habit of thinking unnecessary thoughts, getting lost in unnecessary thoughts. All those forms of different form of addiction, which is something not that you want it to be, but it happens. So there's a whole another side of yourself, which is you have no control over. A wild side, in a way. So the taming basically means, in some sense, you, as we grow older, the aging wisdom you know, not probably everybody has that either, but if you have one, that then you look back in your life, you say, oh my God, you know, that was not good, what I did, or that was not good, what I said. That was not good for others, that was not good for myself. I treated not good myself, I did not treat myself very well. So, so there's a lot of clear recognition of your past self. And clearly, if there is clear recognition of past self, and clearly some sense of, the, if there is a clear recognition, and, and that means you are not no longer that person anymore. You are different. You are more mature. You are more ripened. You are more grounded. You are more aware. You, are more, you guide yourself more. You do things what you wanting to do, not you're driven to do. Or your, or your confusion drives you, your fear drives you, your pain drives you. No, no, your awareness drives your life. So if you see that of more, then that means that some part of you have been tamed or recognized. So a whole set of the foundational practice and the practice is very much like that. 